Hey guys, one of the most common questions we get here at Grand Adventures is should I do the self-guided or the fully guided snowmobile trail tour? Well, I'm gonna walk you through some of the details and then you can decide for yourself which one of these amazing activities you wanna do. Now with the fully guided adventures, you get your choice of one of two locations. In Winter Park, your guides are gonna take you up to the Continental Divide Trail. That's gonna take you up to this special spot, amazing views, that's incredible. Also, you have the choice just down the road of the Trailblazers fully guided trail system. Some of the most incredible views anywhere in the valley. Now on the self-guided tour, you're gonna be at the Winter Park location and you'll have your option of Trail 1, which goes up the Continental Divide to this amazing view and all these great trails, or Trail 2. It takes you down the valley area. Now both the self-guided and the guided use the same snowmobiles. These incredible Ski New Grand Touring. They are big, they are comfortable, they are fun and easy to ride. You get that on both sides. But if you do the guided adventure at the Trailblazers location, you have the option of doing the electric snowmobile. Now that's a very unique experience. It's very fun, all electric. So check that out at the Trailblazers. Both the self-guided and the guided are very similar, but let me walk you some of the pros and cons of each. Starting with the guided, the big difference of course, is you have a guide. The guide is there, to take you along the trail and show you all the fun, interesting things. And the guides do have a few trails that only the guided tours get to go on. When you stop, they will give you a lot of the local knowledge. You're gonna be placed with other people in that tour. So usually that will set the pace. So on the guided tour, you may wanna go slower or faster. The guide is there to make sure that the entire group goes at the comfortable speed of the group as a whole. And of course, with the guided, you don't have to worry about the timing. The guide will get you up there and back. That's what they do. Now, on the other side, the self-guided tour, they show you exactly how to use the snowmobile and how to prepare. These snowmobiles are very easy to use. If you've ever driven a jet ski or an ATV, you most likely will have no problem riding one of these snowmobiles. What's great about the self-guided is it's really a one trail out, one trail back in system. There are two options for trails, so you'll split either trail one that goes up the Continental Divide or down trail two, it goes down into the valley and a whole other set of systems. So you'll go in and back out. It's very easy to do. They have maps on the snowmobiles themselves, so you don't have to worry about getting lost. The advantage of doing the self-guided is you can go at your own pace. You stop where you want, you go when you want, you take time, you can play. There's lots of options when you do the self-guided tour. And on the self-guided, you gotta know the timing, so you gotta know how far you are out, make sure you can get back on time for your rent. That's really the differences between the two. I suggest you make a choice. You wanna go guided or do you wanna go self-guided? And as always, if you got more questions, there's a lot of frequently asked questions on this website. Dig on in, check the chat bot. We'll help you with whatever you need.